Welcome to Mentoring Monday. It's great to be with you at the start of another working week. And today we're picking up on a verse that really is quite well known from John's Gospel. I'm going to read it in its context because the bit that we're coming to is, is set in some amazing statements. It's in chapter 16, verse 33. These things I've spoken to you that in me you may have peace. In the world you'll have tribulation, but be of good cheer, I have overcome the world. It's great, isn't it? This is like a a double solution to a challenge. We've got a world that's full of turmoil, a world that is, 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 is chaotic and has been ever since the fall and will be right through until the Lord redeems the whole situation. But what he's saying is that whilst you're living in the midst of this world, two things. Number one, I'm giving you my peace. And that is just incredible because it means that no matter what's happening around us, we can live in this this almost like a cocoon of peace, in a sense, separating ourselves out from all the pressure around us. But you know, the the rest of what Jesus says in this verse removes us from that sort of cocoon image where we're, we're separated out from the world and are living in a peace bubble to the point where we're actually being told that the reason that Jesus can so confidently give us his peace is that he's actually overcome this world with all of the chaos and everything else that's going on. He's already the one who's overcome. So what we're seeing at the moment with the chaos around us is just the sort of outworkings of something that has already been remedied. He's already paid the price to put everything in order. And even though at this point when he says it, he'd not yet gone to the cross, in his heart, he knew that this, this overruling, this overcoming principle was just so strong that he, he was not submitting to the world, that the world would have to submit to him. And so even as he's saying, you've got peace in the midst of the turmoil, he's also saying, I'm the one who will cause all the turmoil to cease. And one day you're going to see the fulfillment of everything that I'm working through. I have overcome the world. Let's take that full remedy, the peace that he brings and the overcoming reality that he declares to us. Have a great week. Thanks for watching. If you've been watching on Facebook, hit the like button. If you've been watching on YouTube, subscribe to the channel. Thanks.